Hi boys and girls, this is Miss Kim. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, this is a video to show you how to navigate and use Google Classroom. So I'm using my tablet, um, but some of you who are using your laptops or computers, you would just sign in to classroom.google.com. Okay, so let's get started. So first, you choose your classroom. Then at nine o'clock, in the morning, Ms. Moran or I will post your assignments for the day. Click on it. We'll put a little humor to start the day. And it, good morning, 209. Here's your schedule and assignments for today. Number one, sign in. You're going to click on the attendance icon with today's date and type your name. Then click on submit. So if you look under the attachments, you'll see today's date. You'll click on that. Yours might look a little different. But here, you are required to type your name in to show us that you were in for today. Then you'd click on submit. Your response has been recorded. Then we go back to the classroom and look at number two. We'd like you to read for 20 minutes and log it into your reading log. You can read books that are at home or you can go to Mayon or Raz Kids. We've included links to Mayon. And you know, you should know since we've done this many times in school how to log in. And you were also given a sheet with all your login information. Um, your parents were also given a picture. Or you can go on to Raz Kids. Okay, go to the kids' login. Okay. Or number three, writing journal. Everyone should have gotten a their writing notebook. Um, if not, feel free to um, write this in a new writing notebook, but this is your writing journal entry for today. You write a paragraph about how you felt being at home all week. Choose one feeling and give three reasons why you felt that way. Were you happy or sad, excited or bored? Choose one feeling and give three reasons why you felt that way. And don't forget to write the heading on every new page. Number four is math. We'd like you to log into Pearson Realize and complete the online assignment for 9-2. Do pages 517 to 520 in your workbook. So if you go down here and see the icon for Pearson Realize, you click on that. And you're going to sign in with your username. Please do not forget the at NYC. And don't forget your password. And you'll see this pop up on the right is says explore. Feel free to explore that anytime you want. On the left is my work. That's what you're going to press. And if you scroll and you look here, you'll see lesson nine too. You want to get started. And there's four mini assignments, really short. Some of them are very short. The first one is a model, solve and share. And you can even have them read it to you. How can you use place that? The second one is a video. And please watch the whole thing through. It'll stop every now and then for you to think, to give you some thinking time. So just continue to press play. Third, these are just the pages we'd like you to complete in your workbook that was sent home. And the last one is our quick check problems. So you start it. Okay. There are five questions. If you need it to be read to you, you can press play. What number is shown? You'd answer in the box and you'd click on next to go to the next question. I believe by the last one, you would submit your answers. When you finished all these, please send to the teacher. In this case, it's not done because I haven't completed it, but you would be submitting your work there. So that's for math. 
Now we have social studies. Now social studies will not be assigned every day, but I want to show you an example of what it would look like when social studies is assigned. So it says social studies, read pages 120 to 123. So we have included these pages and on my tablet, I'm able to just swipe to the next page. You would read these pages and then you would click on this SS lesson two and answer these questions. So in here, you would write your name. And in most cases, it'll be multiple choice or check boxes. So here, what are the three different types of communities? You need to check three boxes. I'm just gonna check anything right now. And the rest are multiple choice. Please do not forget to submit your answers. Okay, and that's what it looks like. If you ever have questions, please reach out to me or Miss Moran. We'd be more than happy to help you. Okay, we hope that you're well. We miss you. Bye.